name is Anesha Mani Mulford. I'm a painter that works primarily in surgical art, and I have been doing this since 2015. Um, I've had previous projects with the Surgeons Hall Museum in Edinburgh, where I worked as project artist for a, a project about robotic surgery and the human patient robot relationship. Uh, I was brought on to humanize the robot, and it's actually how I got in contact with the matter here. Um, Prof. Cahill. Um, basically found my work through them and got in touch to see if what my portfolio was like and to buy some works. And these are the two behind me. Um, they got bought and they, this sparked a discussion about the work that he was doing at present, which has just come to a close, um, which is why we've timed for this project to finish at the same time, to have this amazing final end of the science and then also the art behind what they are doing. Um, it's been an amazing project. Uh, we've been working with Maeve. I've done the painting side. Um, and it's been a brilliant collaborative project that is a combination of traditional art and very modern sort of aspects and forward thinking uses of technology within art, which we feel is a total Oh, parallel to what is being done in the surgeries that, um, that are doing this pioneering research with AI and fluorescence. My name is Maeve Henley, um, and I'm one of the artists that worked on this collaboration alongside Inesh. Uh, so I'm a digital artist, um, a multimedia artist. I work in film photography and 3D animation. Um, my background is in uh, medical and health art. Um, I previously worked with 3D printing to represent um, the hidden nature of neurological disease and thinking about bringing the brain, which is invisible to most of us, uh, to the forefront uh, of um, our minds and our visual space. Um, when I was working on this project, I got connected with Inesh and she um, and the team at the matter asked me to come on board to work on this collaboration about an art piece about the use of fluorescent dye in uh, surgery and in cancer research. So I was using the digital tool Blender to create fluid simulations that I felt evoked the motion and the fluid and the kind of alive nature of the uh, I used in research. Um, so then alongside Inesh, we created this multimedia piece that had both a 2D element of her exceptional painting, and then with my uh, digital fluid animation video project on top to try and depict in an artistic fashion how uh, we found, we were moved by when we, we saw it, and we wanted to try and put that across uh, the public in a way that could be both interesting uh, for people who know it, and also maybe an art piece in its own right for people. I'm a surgeon in the hospital and a professor in UCD. Uh, this work is, coincides with the successful conclusion of a really great research project uh, that has been a translational project between UCD and the Matter Hospital uh, with our partners in RCSI, IBM Re Research and DiceIFEX. Uh, it's really been amazing to see what Inesh and Maeve have come up with. Uh, having understood the project and seen what has happened, but they've really taken it in a, in a rather beautiful direction that's really improved all of our understandings of it. It's really, it's really been a lovely thing to experience.